On April 13, Thema Newtown experienced tragedy when two residents lost their lives in a crash between the Navy and local youth who were marching on the streets as part of the Bileju Festival. Two individuals died, while several others sustained gunshot wounds. Ni is currently battling an injury. This is the main entrance of the Eastern Naval Command and these are some of the broken bottles and stones that allegedly were spelted at the soldiers from the onset that led to the shooting. The military's public relations office has denied causing the fatalities while the Thermon Traditional Council attributes the blame to the military. The impression that they've created is as though we attack them. We, the youth, cannot attack a military. They rather attack us. You know, it's our festival, Pelejo. I mean, it's a celebration. And so when you are driving, the speed at which you come with, it's even an attack. They will even see that as though you are attacking them. Because at that point, any car, any truck, any machine that is coming is supposed to come with a certain speed. The council is now demanding a formal apology while urging the youth to prioritize peace. We pray that the Navy will see the sense in what we are saying. Either reissue a statement and apologize to all that they have said, or come, let's sit together and enjoy joy and see how best we can bring peace to the community and affected ones. Secretary of the Awudum Sipi, Ni Amal Sompunu, confirmed that the festival will proceed as planned despite the tragedy. We are peeved, but the festival celebration is also so important for us that we will not do anything to mar the celebration. Despite the incidents, so we are still, still appealing for CAP so that we end everything successfully because we are yet, yet to end. The council expressed doubts about the committee's findings, especially given the lack of public discourse of a similar incident last year.